hello guys welcome to my youtube channel and in this tutorial i'm going to show you how i implemented this light mode dark mode toggle function using next.js and material ui so as most of you guys know in this channel i'm going to share with you the everyday things that i learn as software engineer and very useful things and production level things uh, that every one of you can get help with so in particular in this particular video like uh, i didn't find any kind of uh, straightforward articles videos regarding this feature so i thought of sharing with you guys how to do this how to implement this uh, light mod dark mod toggle function using material ui version 5 and i think it's next day's 13th version so stay tuned subscribe to my youtube channel let's get started okay guys as you can see uh, i have this simple left bar in my index.psx page so you can see after going to this uh, left bar this is a uh, built using material UI. so let me show you the uh, running application so this is a simple navigation bar so what i'm going to do is i'm going to implement this toggle function so that once you toggle it it will change to light mode and dark mode so i will tell you the over overview of the things uh, what i'm going to do guys so here in this code what i'm going to do is in this app.txe you can see uh, we have injected a theme for our entire application using theme provider so what i'm going to do is i'm going to create a function so that once you click that function you can change the theme inside so we are going to create a theme in this uh, app.tsx and we are going to change the theme mode using a function and we are going to pass that function through this component as a prop and what we are going to do is once we pass that function to the component in here in, in this app.txs file we are going to catch that function from our index.tsx file and after that we are going to pass it for the relevant child a component in my case it's this left bar so we are going to create a function that can manipulate the theme inside the tsx file and we are going to pass it for the in the component and we are going to catch that uh, passed function and we are going to pass it as a prop for our left bar child component so that's the overview uh, that i'm going to do so i don't i don't like to take your time to see that uh, you are to waste your time by looking at how i am coding so i will simply go with the code and also i will upload the link github link for this repository so that you can study and do it yourself as well so uh, let's get started so in the app.txs file as i said what you're going to do is uh, we are going to uh, create that function so let's check so using use state first of all let's uh, let's guys first of all let's create this theme so let's create this theme in here like this and i'm going to import this uh, create theme from in ui and as you can see guys in here uh, we can use this uh, mod like you know this mod can be light or dark what we are going to do is using a function we are going to change the value of this mod value here why this is not importing Where's this thing provided? Okay. I don't know why it's not so important. Uh, as I said, what I'm going to do is in here, I'm going to using React use state. So I'm going to change this mod value. So I have to. Is at the beginning, so yeah. 
And here, like what I'm going to do is, uh, like I'm going to give the type, 11 type. I don't know, my machine is a bit slow. all good and here what I'm going to do is I'm going to create that uh, function that which can change the in here you can see it can change the mode value this is set mode it can change the mode value so what I'm going to do is I'm going to pass the struggle team in here component the toggle T and guys what we have to do is previously we used this theme in here the theme that we used here but now I'm going to create a new theme using this create theme so one thing we have to be, I have to be clear here is like this function like here what i have done is i am going to change this mod value using a set mod using new state i am going to change this mod value but you can uh, like you know you can create your own method of maybe you can create a separate thing like you can assign a separate object as thing so that's up to you guys so what i have done here is i have simply changed this mod value so if you guys are confused in material ui you know, there are there's an inbuilt mode like dark theme and light mode when you select dark it uh, automatically change this uh, button primary colors button secondary colors for these uh, rgba dark values but if you need very specific dark mode values what you can do is uh, you can create your own logic in here instead of changing this mode value you can change the entire you can change the reference of the entire theme to a separate uh, theme object and you can pass it here so that thing is up to you guys so you can manipulate that task so in here what I have done is I have simply uh, used this toggle theme and change this value in here and I'm not going to use this uh, theme.ts file inside so I'm going to go with the default values provided by in UI but I know that's not the case for you guys so you can like based on your preference you can change this theme value using a function so what you do is after passing this function for the com in for the component you can catch it only from here you can catch it from the index.tsh file so i will show you how you can catch it and here what you do is uh, inside this home you can Oops, well, you see, we are passing in here. We can set our uh, toggle theme prop that we are going to send, and also we have to assign the type for the toggle theme. So, I'm going to go with React uh, Mouse Event Handler. Uh, yeah and here what we can do is we can simply pass this toggle team to our left uh, bar I'll go with the toggle team of in here we can assign dot Team and in the left bar we can 
get that dot as usual. So I will just destruct it from here. So this you are for this specific paper I will just add any here uh, and let's try to run it from here and change Team. so we are we can execute this toggle team from here so let's try guys how it's going to work see it's working like a charm so I will add this code here so I will highly recommend you guys to try it yourself go through the code understand the code and try it yourself and i'm also planning to create a discord channel so every one of us can get together newcomers of uh, currently who are doing software engineering can get together and discuss uh, the practical scenarios that we come across highly request you guys to subscribe to my channel it helps me a lot as you guys may have noticed i came across a simple uh, type issue here i use this type for my double thing seems like it's not returning anything and also it's not getting any uh, parameters so i use this instead of the previous uh, react uh, type so it works fine so i use the same uh, type in here as well so it works pretty cool here uh, thank you guys have a nice day and stay tuned